I'm Matt Jokel and I'm an associate professor in the School of Natural Resources in the Department of Geosciences here at the University of Nebraska-Lincoln. Nebraska does have earthquakes, believe it or not, but we've not had a major damaging earthquake in over 150 years of keeping records. The earthquakes of which we're aware in the history of Nebraska have all been relatively minor ones, most of them below five on the Richter scale. Earthquakes are caused by movements in the Earth's crust. Earthquakes are not just the results of brittle breakage of the Earth's crust. As a matter of fact, the Earth's crust is somewhat elastic, and it is that elastic response that causes the shaking during an earthquake. We do have faults mapped in Nebraska, to be sure, but it's very difficult to associate any given earthquake in the history of Nebraska with any particular fault. What that means to me is we have a long way to go in understanding the geologic structure of Nebraska and the number of faults that we have mapped is probably only the tip of the iceberg. So everyone should be aware of what to do in the event of earthquake. The three main rules are dropping, covering, and holding on. Get as close to the floor or to the ground surface as you can once you feel shaking occurring. Get under a heavy, sturdy piece of furniture or another object that is unlikely to collapse if debris falls on it. The final rule is to hold on hold on to some solid object and be prepared to endure shaking for some period of time. Everyone should know something about the geologic background of earthquakes, but no one should worry too much about being hurt or having their property damaged here in Nebraska by earthquake activity.